The hearing impaired community gathered to commemorate and draw the attention to the public, urging them to learn sign language as a way to aid communication, with a major emphasis being on the current government, urging them to come up with more special schools to enable children with hearing impairment to learn and interact. These kids could not hide their joy as they danced and entertained the congregation. Sign language. With a unique way of communication, they too will accommodate each other. One of their teachers who has totally mastered the sign language interprets for the audience as the kids non-verbally shared their stories. How old are you? Seven or six or seven. During the COVID-19 period, difficulties among the hearing impaired increased, leading to lack of inclusiveness along with a breakdown of their mental, physical and social health. But for one mother, this day is a blessing for her and her young daughter. She narrates how she has till date lived in denial that her daughter cannot speak. Up to now I'm still living in denial, but somehow it's better. At first, you know, as any mother you like to see your child calling mom, baba and others. But for me I waited, I waited until I felt that maybe it's just the normal lateness of talk of starting to speak. So I had to take her to early child school. This is another parent. He goes by the name Baba Keith. From a distance, it's hard to tell that Keith has a hearing impairment. Sadly, his dad says he has never spoken. Uh, but despite finding ways to accommodate their child, certain challenges among them, stigma, lack of equipped classrooms, are still rampant. They always accuse the deaf child of every wrong because she cannot talk for herself. So everything happens wrong when they're playing, it's the deaf child, it's the deaf child. So you see the child, the child feel, feels that she does not fit. So she'll rather stay alone. After spending a day with these kids, you will discover that learning sign language is really fun. My best food is ugali and fish. My best game is football. And I'm a sign language champion. Well, many parents with kids who need special needs have had to go an extra mile and learn the basics of sign language. Wanjiro Maina, K24 TV.